The Centre. Last month, the Sri Lankan government launched a smear campaign against international civil society groups, including ones right here in Canada. These groups helped lead the successful push for an international independent investigation into the atrocities committed during the Sri Lankan Civil War. What actions are the government taking to protect peaceful Canadian citizens against the Sri Lankan ban? And will the minister consider, consider targeted sanctions against those responsible for abuses and repression, as was recommended by the Foreign Affairs Committee in 2009? The Honourable Minister of Foreign Affairs. Mr. Speaker, no government anywhere in the world, no leader any, in, of any government in the world has stood up more strongly and more loudly than the Prime Minister of Canada when it comes to the challenges facing the people of Sri Lanka. Absolutely correct. I want to tell the member opposite, we're certainly very pleased to continue our strong leadership on Sri Lanka. We're pleased to uh, work with him and hear ideas and suggestions on how we can build on the strong record that we've taken to stand up against the war crimes, to call for accountability, and to stand up against the growing authoritarian trend across Sri Lanka, Mr. Speaker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well,